Hello folks, this has gone by the spy. We'll come to you live on online for more Transformers the Gaming Series. The battle of the last uh, showdown is uh, taking its toll on both sides so far as so oh, things are getting a little bit dicey uh, as the tide has shifted thanks to Jazz, which was a little bit of a worried since, well, since uh, the first, since since Starscream and Blackout got the drop on Jazz on the first time, but not the second time, because I put all the stops uh, there, and then I should have because I was messing around on the first time, but, but, now uh, I we've managed to be able to take out two of the best warriors of the Decepticons that Megatron has, Blackout and Starscream, but now a third enemy had appeared before Jazz and, well, Brawl uh, is his name, and Ironhide, and he, and Ironhide and I needs to make sure that Jazz gets back up before Brawl def kills Jazz. Jazz was already worn out, uh, taken on uh, to uh, Decepticons, which was the officers of Megatron's ranks. <laughs> you know, people would think in the streets that racing wouldn't do any much good to save the world because street racers uh, race for either two things, for money and uh, to be able to uh, build some sort of life uh, amongst the street people's families of homies or um hombres or niggas yeah probably i never should have said that um but um but now <laughs> now racing <laughs> how is how did it come to uh, this that racing has ever became a thing that's beyond our imagination <laughs> well i'm not complaining even a single bit even though that uh, the autobots haven't exactly got the transformation up in military aspects of vehicles like the decepticons been doing because they're getting all the shits and giggles all the the cool shit we have something uh, that these decepticons don't Righteousness, the liberty for all the rights of free people and all species for all sentient beings. And that is something that we're going to prove against its Decepticons in this episode like the other two. And all those uh, episodes that's been shown in this series so far. So without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, let's get and move on now. Off screen, I've only managed to uh, get 69 cubes for a third challenge. I still haven't exactly found another icon yet, so, um, it's hard to find here, but uh, we'll be able to find it. I'll be able to find it later. Let's do this. Scavenger. Okay. We can do this. Ah, oh, switching into Bumblebee. Ah, there it is.
Who would have thunk it that we'd be finding cogs around the burger stand? Alright. Now. Now this is out of the way. Let's go through and get to Jazz. I'm a little bit worried uh, about him right now. As I said before, uh, Jazz and I just uh, finished up two uh, heavy uh, officers uh, of the Decepticon ranks, start screaming blackout. So if uh, he's encountering another uh, heavy set of Decepticons, and then Jazz is going to need our help. Hope we're not too late. What? No! Bastard? And painful? You'll pay for this brawl? Objective? Destroy brawl? Brawl has extinguished Jazz's spark. Refer your fallen brother in arms by destroying brawl by any means necessary. Now you want to understand how, what Autobots feel about their fallen comrades? For the fallen? For Jazz? Is that what you got, bro? We're going to smash you into little tiny pieces. As soon as we deal with your cronies, bra, we're going to come after you next. That was for Cybertron! And that one's for Manhattan! Is that all you got? It's nothing compared to what Jazz felt. It's nothing compared to the people suffering. Come on!
I'm going to kick that metal ass of yours until candy comes out. Rhino Charger, huh? Come on, come on, Oppo, Umbo, Underlay, Turo. Ulay. Feel the righteous burning fury of the liberty of justice. This low uh, hide and go to this wild goose chase ends here. Want hell? Then welcome to the land of hell that your master Megatron wants to create, you son of a bitch. <sighs> that one's for you, Chaz. Battle's done, but war is far from over. Bubblebee. Thought we have already dealt with him uh, in a couple of levels ago. Oh, oh well, I have a feeling that we would be seeing that guy again. Oh well, we've changed a lot since we first encountered him. So right now, this has gone by the spy, uh, turning offline for now.